Hey, Pat, it's Midnight Designer, and we are back playing Seven Days Today. And in the last episode, we scored ourselves a crossbow, and for our next trick, we are going to try to get ourselves a pickaxe. So let's see how much uh, iron. This is brass. I don't know why you're in here. Uh, how much iron do we has? No, put you in here, brass tacks. With all of our beautiful weapons, including that SMG we scored in the... Um, uh, uh, between episodes loot run. Okay, so let's see how much... I know... I mean, technically, I can do this. And, whoa, that was a weird sort of delay thing. So, 10. So, each ingot is three. Right? Oh, and this has already got a little bit in her. So, let's see what that gets us. And maybe... Because I think now a pickaxe, uh, I think now a pickaxe only requires three ingots. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, it's new and super schmexy. So let's check that out. And you are, where's the little bar? Is it, what happened? It stopped. That was weird. Um, that that did not happen as I had thought it would happen. Is this like filling up? It's going up. It's going up. It's going up. It's going up. Will the can be enough to put it over? Okay, so how much is it going to... Will that get us there? I can't tell if it's moving. There we go. Okay, there's something glitchy or different with the furnaces now. So I'm not sure entirely what that was about. So let's uh, get some sticks. Oh, in between, I did brew up some um, goldenrod tea. So we got some there, got some there. So let's, what password, what? Uh, all right, let's do this and this. And as soon as we can get outside, we'll get some logs and drop those in there. Because as I understand it, the, um, the, the map heats up by the number of items that get burned in the uh, forge or, or fire. So if you are burning 50 jillion sticks, you, you will heat up the map more than you would if you were burning, say, uh, one coal or block. Um, even though you'd be cooking for the same amount of time. So, uh, at least that's how I believe it worked. Look at this. Pickaxe! This is perfect because now that, now we hit... Wait, what? Faulty? Your mama's faulty. Quality... Oh, man. Faulty. That's messed up. That's a fine pickaxe. You're faulty. Anyway, but now we have a tool, and I really feel like we are moving so much slower than we used to. I wonder if that's a feature. But now we has pickaxe, and we can get through metal doors. 
if you know what I mean. <laughs> what do you? How you like me now, sucker? Um, uh oh, locked door. You know what that means? There could be goodness in here. All right. So now you're making a wood sound. We're back to doing this again, huh? Now your metal. What what what's in here? <gasps> Ooh. An untouched gun safe. Well, let's touch it, shall we? Sorry, I had to take a drink of a delicious beverage. Coffee. Oh, look at that. Oh, we win the game. Look at all the garbage they kept in their safe. Another cash register, which I think is just going to have stuff like paper and casino chips. Oh, but it does make a cool sound. That's kind of fun. That's kind of fun. And you, empty fog cabinet is empty. And take you. And take you. So, really. Really, we should grab some of these, right? And I think because we did not get a great pickaxe. I will be hesitant to um, repair this over getting a new one and maybe trying to get a better quality. I think I understand how that works. So let's head up here and see what there is to see. Ooh, a cooking pot right out in the open. Thank you. And it does seem like there's a little bit more loot in the um, kitchens, or at least food. But maybe that's just my wishful thinking. All right, let's get in here. Because it is getting later in today. Today. And we will want to get back. Hello, desk. What do you have? You know what? I'm switching because uh, the this is not doing it for me. Nice. And you, I think we can scrap these now. We can scrap pants into cloth. Yes, we can. All right. And forge ahead, home maintenance. I think we have all the knowledge of both of these books. Okay, so we got all this. We did all that. This is nothing. This is nothing. So let's head up to the roof. And hello, backpack. We are. I I was watching uh, Zio. Uh, actually, I, his yesterday video. I was just watching today, and he was saying that <clears throat> he noticed that. We seem to move slower in the game now. So, I, and I believe that to be true for sure because I definitely feel like we are moving slower. Um, okay, so let's, let's get back in here. And it is getting close to night. Nope. <laughs> you know what? I am so drunk. <clears throat> I walked into the wrong house, I think. No, it's our house. It's blue. I just don't know how to walk around. This is this is it. Way to go, Midnight. You like took five minutes off the video game. Why was this blocked? 
What were you thinking? I don't know. All right, so let's, since I will wind up walking through here more than anywhere else, let's just do this and upgrade this. Do I have wood on me? I have wood on me. Let's upgrade. There. That's one less problem to worry about. That way I won't walk through there accidentally. See, I am going super slow and my frames are low, but they're not ridiculously low. So let's head up here. Let's get our, no, come on. Oh, I placed the, I put a, f what is, why can I not go up the ladder now? Yeah, it's something wrong with ladders and uh, cutting off the bottom one. I was having problems with this before. It was not letting me like jump up and get onto the ladder. So I don't know. And now I can't. Oh, this is, this sucks. Okay, this thing has to go. Okay, can I go up the ladder now? Yes, I can. All right. Fantastic. Fantastic. Yeah, that... I'm not sure what is different about ladders and how all that works. But I know how to walk up a ladder in, in Seven Days to Die. And it was just not happening for me. All right. So, let's put you all in here. And a minute 20. Let's just drop you in there. Now they said that they have uh, that they have fixed the um, the issues with the furnace, so we will have to see how all that goes. And actually, I could have burned all these stupid stocks. That could have been a thing I did. But while we're thinking about it, while we're thinking about having knowledge, let's uh, make sure we have knowledge. Okay, so we have all that. We know all that. Do we know all this? We know all this. Okay, so we craft these now into paper. Fantastic. Okay. Yeah, there's something funky. Of so many funky things. It's like we're in funky town. Wow, that was terrible. Let's get some frames. Did I craft my paper? It made 46? That was weird. That's a weird... It made 46. So each... It made... Oh, did I already have six paper? <laughs> it made 46. No, it made 40. And you had six. And so 40 plus six is... Wait for it. 46 and now let's make some coffee with a hint of cushion Ooh, did they reduce the coffee cook time seems like they did so that's pretty cool if that's true now can you turn paper into books oh yes you can that's very cool because that will reduce the storage space now you probably could do that before and i just never messed with it because i was never a big uh shotgun person so um yeah so uh, paper and books were not a priority for me so let's get some stuff put away here um, and I guess no I guess I'll keep all this for now until I grow weary of it um, now I'm presuming since these are all different yeah they won't stack because they're different uh, quality types or whatever so yeah so there is that 
Um, anything else that will go in here? Nah. Let's put you here. Let's put you here. And you. We'll get you and you. And this. And first aid supplies go in here also. Water. And let's see here. Just start putting this stuff in here, I guess. Doesn't have to be in any particular. Of course, we should stack like items. Um, 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 um. I keep the repair tool on me. Uh, this is a fine club. That's a fine club. So I put that fine club in there. Put you in here, you on the bar, you up here. Hold on to you for a second. And where are we here? Almost done with the coffee. Nice. So let's have a drinky drink. And take you. All right, so let's see here. <clears throat> Shovel. It's still four. Wow. That seems really expensive in light of the pickaxe being reduced. And how, how much is the fire axe? I think it's just two, right? Yeah, still just two. Okay, so they changed the recipe. <clears throat> Excuse me. They changed the recipe for the uh, pickaxe, but not the other items. Wait, is that a board? Um, hard to say. Oh, didn't quite make the jump. And I don't, <clears throat> I don't have any frames on me anymore. Somebody whack my house. <clears throat> I'm not sensed. Ain't no sense in that. Okay, well, it just got very dark very fast. So I am going to cut here and uh, I will come back in the morning. So you hang tight and I will be right back. And morning followed. So we are here in the morning of it all. And I decided to go ahead since we had leather and I had time to kill. I made some leather armor. Um, so because I have a feeling based on what I can hear at any rate why did i put the leather in there based on what i can hear uh we're going to need some armor because the enemy has not left so we're in one of those situations where they still know where we are even though we are undetected so so let's just see and it may be Okay, so they are not on this floor yet. Whoa. But they want to be in my house. Are they are they in the building? So maybe we should just hightail it out the front. Cause I think like all unpleasant assault like all unpleasant assaults, it is coming from the rear. Yes it is. Hello, nurse. Whoa. They uh 
They've improved the iron sights, but they took away my red dot. <laughs> I need my red dot. I, uh, I need to enforce red dot compliance. Is this... Whoa! Did maybe the crosshairs become more accurate? Like instead of having to place them in the bottom right quadrant of the crosshair, maybe they flat out... Um, so let's put him right in the box and see what happens. Nope. Of course, that might have been me. But this is not better, in my humble opinion. Whoa, did you see all those guys? They're like, hey, crossbow. You got a crossbow. We want to see it. Whoa. All right. So... But yeah, they're, um, all right, let's try, see my fingers in the way. So I guess the object is put them next to your finger or just shoot over their heads as like a warning. So if we are aiming, we put his head there. All right. Now all of these dead zomberts are going to turn into corpse blocks and mess up the neighborhood. So that, see that one's already gone. Okay, is there, uh, is there, s whoa, hey, 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 gent, whoa, holy dirt. So I guess this little horde kind of tracked toward me, ish, or at least where I had been. Let's hit them with this very fine club. Well, howdy, nurse. Yeah, the crosshairs seem to be more accurate. Ooh, beakers, lovely. So I be and I believe we have blood draw kits. So we are set to go with regard to um, being able to start generating uh, grain alcohol for first aid kits because we have corn and. Obviously, we will need to start doing some mining for some potassium nitrate. Um, cool. So, that was a lot of fun. <laughs> Seems like we didn't get a lot done in this episode, but, uh, you know, we have a, a pickaxe. Uh, we did score uh, some interesting loot. And I think in our next episode, we need to basify this building so that we can start actually building our actual base. So we need some egress out of this second floor that is not running through a mess of Zomberts downstairs. So we will, uh, in the next episode, we'll cut down some trees and make some arrangements, if you know what I mean. But if you like this video, please hit the like button. If you want to see more, subscribe. If you want to start a conversation, why don't you start one? Where? In the comment section below. I think we're starting to get to um, to a point where we're, we're past the uh, high adrenaline, will we survive? And now we can start doing a thing as soon as I learn how to aim. <laughs> Thanks for watching and have a great day.